Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Burping Contest. This one is extra special extra. because when this series started, it started off with one man, and that is the bearded beauty, Christian Klemp. And we started off the, the series with Zevia and IBC root beer. And Zevia blew our mind. We thought the IBC root beer was going to take the cake on that one. And since that night, I've tried to replicate what I was able to do with Zevia, and I have been unable to do it. Now I wanna thank everybody for their suggestions and everything. Tonight, we went ahead with Christian Klemp's personal stock of Zevia. So we have Mountain Zevia, we have Grape, and we have Cherry Cola. We are ready to dive in, and it's starting out very similar to the last time we did this because we filled their bellies full of Taco Bell. I'm excited. I've been uh, raring and ready to go with another burping contest video since the Q&A, which again, thank you everyone for dropping all the questions. I will answer those on another Q&A video. Again, continue to drop questions down in the comment section. I answer the comment section. I reply. I love to interact with you guys. So make sure you drop down your thoughts, your comments. Who won tonight's rematch? Dave, you did not win. Thank you. And you know the only person, the one person who voted for Dave? My brother. Seth, what are you thinking? No, oh, my brother Seth. Everyone else, clear across the board, voted for me. So I mean, I still won. Landslide victory, Dave. But Seth, I understand you don't want to come across as bias. Come on. You're coming across as bias. You're coming bias. across as bias. Not voting for Jesse. Yeah. You can't just vote against me because we're brothers. Like, if anything, you should always vote for. I mean, I'm not always vote for your yeah, brother. I'm not hurt. I'm not hurt by or anything, but it's okay, man. It's okay. Yeah, I mean, it's it's in the past now. Yeah, so we're moving on and we're working through. <sighs> I love you, Seth. Uh, hopefully, this time I'll uh, I'll find some retribution. And Seth, that doesn't mean you can only just vote for him today. Yes, it does. Yes, it I mean, does. I mean, you, you got to watch the rest of the video to really decide who. You know, and as a good sport, I agree. On that note, what what is tonight's what? first Burpacola? So we start on the outside and work our way in. Let's do it. Let's Mountain Zevia it up. So tonight's first Burpacola is Mountain Zevia. Crack open, a sugar-free, soda pop, and burp. Burp the night away. All right, Burpacola's up. Cheers. Let's get this party started. There's that foam again. <laughs> yeah, a little foamy, especially at the beginning. Yep. But as you burp more, the foam gets less. Yep, it does. Works that foam out. <laughs> Man, that one is broken in like three spots for me. Yours is kind of like maybe eight. Yeah, mine is like eight. a really weird taste, kind of like corn, and I haven't had corn in a very, very long you know, time. You know what that reminds me of? I don't remember eating corn. <laughs> what? I didn't have any corn! Oh, that was great. Thank you, Mike Myers. <clears throat> I just literally threw up in my mouth. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so far, the Zevia twist that I had last time is still doing better than the Mountain Zevia. One can down. Ooh, that was girthy. That was girty. Gert? <coughs> Gert? Hey, Hi, Gert. Hey, Gert. Next time you're in Des Moines, burping contest. Three of us. Us three, absolutely. Yeah. 100%. Because the goal is to get all of us guys at a round table bur wow. burping contest. That's Seth the goal. included. Oh, absolutely. <coughs> 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 Chug, 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 chug. Mountain Zevia is complete. Wow, we didn't even rehearse that. We did at the same time. That was great. Next, ladies and gentlemen, is the beautiful grape. Tell us about the grape, Christian. It is very grapey. And what does it suggest that we do? Live your best. Live your best. Well, I guess it's suggesting that you live your best because it doesn't say live our best. Wow. Wow. Uh, yeah, live your live best. Live your best. Enjoy living your best. And we're going to do it grappe style. Burbacola number two, grappe. Right. Let's do this. 
Cheers. It's really smooth. Oh, yeah. oh, oh. oh. <laughs> the elevator got stuck. Here, here, let me push the let me push the top floor button. It's still going down. I better ride the horse some more. Where are you going, Jesse? Old Town Road. It's the stupidest thing I've ever seen on any of my videos. I think I think you have maybe just crossed a line. I don't know if it's. That's all right. I don't know if it's all your subscribers or, or what, but the pressure's getting to you, huh? It is. I tried to come up with the best joke I could think of, and it blew up in my face. That's what she said. You forgive me? Yes. Can I try again? Brothers for life. Do you mean it? Always. Forever? And ever. Oh. All right, back to the great. Back to the great. That was rehearsed, just so you know. Yeah. <laughs> This is, this is getting pretty burpy down here. It is. Get a lot of that air in the belly. In the belly. Not the ballet, the belly. The belly. The stomach. <laughs> Stop the people from coming up on that one. <laughs> Surprise, bird. <laughs> Daddy. <laughs> Burping contest rematch. Puke free version. Oh, that's the third time I puked in my mouth. Ends now. If anyone has questioned that I, I put all of myself into these <coughs> these burps, next time I throw up in my mouth, I'll literally just puke it out so you can see I'm not lying. I'll puke it right into Christian's hand so he can hold it up to the camera and see, see, that's puke. Brothers for life. Brothers for life. Amen, forever and ever. Endeavor. <laughs> <laughs> it was so, it was so lackadaisical. You were so relaxed. It's like you just crawled up and was like, what's up? <laughs> nice. Sounds like you said Eric. Who's Eric? I who's, don't know. Who's Eric? Maybe, maybe I was saying something backwards. Can you uh, take that backwards? No, no, no. Ah, that makes more sense. Yeah. That makes more sense. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> Right in his face. What uh, if I caught I didn't it? Hold back. I just what went if, straight and I face. caught it and burped it back. No, and it sounded exactly the same. It didn't go. Well. <laughs> and the last one was like a little rivet of a frog. That was like a trademark burp. <laughs> yeah, it was. It really was. <laughs> like that is a stock sound clip. Yes, right it was. You should sell it. I should. I give you rights here on Thank you, camera. Thank you. <laughs> nice. Down. Now to the final, but definitely not least, cherry cola. Cherry cola. For those that love Coca Cola, cherry. Coca Cola and, cherry. And. And. Pepsi Wild cherry. Ooh, it's true. This is a very, very close runner up. Different. Yes. Not the same. Correct. Keep that in mind. Correct. But still very good. Still very good. That that grape was really good. That it's very grape. Yeah. Very grapey. Grapeish. Great. Grape? Very grape. We got an accent. 
Cherry Cola. Cherry Cola. Burpa Cola, number three. <laughs> Cheers, fam. Definitely like a... Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, uh. It's very comparative to a uh, more of a Pepsi, Cherry Pepsi, I think, than Cherry Coke. <laughs> That went through my nose. I think the thing with Zevia is the aftertaste. Like you, you lose the flavor of the soda at the aftertaste. That's what it, you're like. Oh yeah, this is Zevia. <laughs> it's not a bad aftertaste. Though. No, it's not. It's just yeah. different. Yeah. That for people on keto, when you're on keto for an extended period of time, your taste buds change and they evolve. And so Zevia for me will taste different than it does for Christian because the, the sugar substitutes that are in this react differently with my taste buds because I don't have sugar in my system. And he still has sugar uh, from other sources of food, carbs and whatnot. And so it's gonna taste different to him. So if you're looking for another reason to enjoy more of these low calorie, no carb, no sugar beverages, keto does make things taste better. <laughs> it sounded like, like a machine gun shooting out shampoo foam. Accurate description. Uh Let's see if I can get a little rapid fire gun going here. <clears throat> I still got a little too much foam in there. People like the... the, the <laughs> I got a little too much foam in there! Ooh, I put the kids as to you, bed as you, that one! As you do this. <laughs> yep, make sure the kids are out of the room. This is not suitable for those under the age of 18. <laughs> Speaking of Star Wars language. Those were little, little guys. Uh, 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 Where did that one come <laughs> from? That's what I wanted. Jeez. That was an alien. Yes, it was. Uh, I just thought about the fact that your wife is less than 50 <laughs> feet away from us right now. Well, it's 8.30. Maybe she's putting the... Put Lucy to bed. Yeah. Lucy's she might be so transfixed by the burps. Lucy's bedtime is about 8 o'clock. So oh, okay. Probably, probably already put her to bed. Yeah, yeah we, we uh, burp late at night. Mm -hmm. For those, those parents out there, this is late at night. It is. <clears throat> Aliens are talking. I love the inflection. Yeah. Love the inflection. <coughs> Who do you think you are? <coughs> You should be embarrassed. Then he was getting weird. <laughs> okay, that was the clear, clear winning burp right there. I think that echoed. Sometimes you just gotta sit in the, the, the chamber for a while. <laughs> this Cherry Cole is doing his job. <laughs> yeah, it is. Gosh dang. We ended with this. Yep. <clears throat> you got ABC, yeah. <laughs> I'll see if I can get DEF. Chest is starting to hurt from all the air. Yeah, we need that refuel. We're almost there. <laughs> Your face looks so cute when you said that. Z B No. Now I know we gotta get the rest of this out. <laughs> that one was a D. You gritted your way through that C's. <laughs> yeah. So now I, I need to do next time, won't you sing with me? Next time, won't you sing? There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. We just finished 
the whole alphabet <laughs> and the alphabet song. <laughs> There's been some pretty gross verse on this one. <laughs> Should I chug the rest of this to see if I can get some good burps out of the longevity? Or do half and then half? How much do you have left? Yeah, yeah, about right here, probably. I think it's about here. Maybe like it. Okay, so we're close. <laughs> My stomach legitimately hurts. Yeah. <sighs> Alright, let's finish it. Let's finish this. <laughs> Cola number three, Cherry Cola. Fantastic, it burped up, it beat out the Zevia Twist. However, I would say that there is a possibility that the combination of all three, one after the other after the other, ended up with so much, wow, you stink. <laughs> my gosh. <laughs> oh man, it's making my eyes water. You're welcome. Again, Zevia, it's literally, it's fantastic. Fantastic, fans. Fantastic, you. You fans are fantastic. Listen, I want to give you guys the content that you love. If you like, love, desire burping contest videos, I need you to let me know in the comment section. I read my comments. I reply to my comments. Don't be shy. Let me know you like it by hitting that thumbs up. And that also helps me out. It helps my channel, helps my channel grow. Hit that subscribe button because there are three previous burping contest videos already up. This is number four, this is episode number four. There is going to be more burping contest videos. I just wanna know that you guys enjoy this. Subscribe so you don't miss out. Notification bell, again, it helps me out. It helps drive traffic to my channel and it helps me build more content. Because when I'm getting feedback from you guys, it's just driving me to make more content and more content and more content. So just thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for interacting and enjoying these videos <coughs> and for taking time to get to know myself as well as my friends like the bearded beauty, Christian Klemp. <laughs> oh yeah, that's good. That is another uh, reverberating. Another barn burner, one might say. And if there's other suggestions that you'd like to see within reason, I've got some pretty weird requests. I am only but a human, so just understand that. People have asked for farting contests. As a person on keto, I don't really get gas because I don't eat food that gives the body gas. It's a little dangerous. It's very dangerous because you can shart and you can be pooping everywhere. As a human being to fart consistently is very, very difficult to do. And to have a camera at the ready to record every single time you fart is very difficult. Just throw that out there. Not saying that at some point in time down the road, it's not gonna be possible. Maybe it will and if it is possible, let's do it. But in the meantime, <laughs> it's just not gonna happen. I'm just gonna throw that out there. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> But anyways, on behalf of my, my best friend, my man, my guy, Christian Klimp, ladies and gentlemen, and his wonderful basement with the, with the beautiful lighting and the guitars, some future content that is coming. This guy and I have a history of working on music. If you watched my initial episode of Blast From The Past, that episode opens with a clip of myself and Christian from 2011, nine years ago listening to one of our songs that we made together for the first time out in a public setting. We are really hoping to get back in the studio and make some new music this year. And we want to document that and we want to showcase that on my channel. Looking out for that, again, we don't have a time frame for that at all right now. It's just a, an idea that we kind of came up with tonight while we were hanging out. But it, it's something that we want to work on. Also, I'm gonna leave with this one awesome little fact. Merchandise is coming. It's on the official merchandise, is on its way. I don't have an exact time frame on when it's going to be available, but I want you to know that we are in the process of making it happen. This man right here and I are collaborating on designs for stuff. Whether it's t-shirts or hoodies or hats or stickers, whatever it is, let me know what you guys want. What kind of merch do you enjoy the most? And we will see what we can do and get that, uh, get that going. So on that note, happy, Happy New Year. Happy 2020 to everybody. I love you all. Thank you for all your support. And as always, 
It is all knee and no foot. And we will see you later.